Hi traders, just want to take you through the key news releases for the week ahead. Now Monday there's a number of holidays, so the market may be rather slow going. But let's go through the red items, time shown on Queensland time. So getting into Wednesday on the midnight. For the US we've got CB Consumer Confidence, into the morning, 9am for the Aussie, RBA Governor Low Speaks, 11.30am for the Aussie, we've got the CPI data, so it's going to be volatile at that time. Expecting inflation then maybe to just uptick. Getting in to the Euro here, it's all day. The German prelim CPI month to month. There might be a specific time later in the week posted. At the moment it's just saying all day. At 10.30pm for Canada we've got GDP figures month to month. Into Thursday midnight for the US. The jolts, job openings. And moving into the evening for Thursday, 10.15 p.m. for the U.S. ADP non-farm employment change. 10.30 p.m. for the U.S. unemployment claims. And then into Friday on the midnight. For the U.S. ISM manufacturing PMI data. And then getting into the evening on Friday, 10.30 p.m. For the U.S. we have the average hourly earnings, non-farm employment change, and the unemployment rate. Okay traders, those are the key news releases for the week ahead. Make sure that you review them so that you can manage your trades effectively and have a great trading week ahead. Now if you'd like to follow my Forex trading analysis throughout the week, why not subscribe to the ACY Securities live interactive trading feed Telegram channel. Simply contact Nathan Bray at acy.com to get access.